Hey guys, today I will be listing my top 10 favorite lift companies of all time. 10. Gartk, Aritco, Gartk and Aritco are different companies but then at the same time they're not, if that makes any sense xd. Most of their lifts use parts from the other company. Anyways, they make arguably the best platform lifts on the market, they're surprisingly well built and they look quite nice in design. 9. Elan Lifts Elan lifts make some pretty reasonable lifts with a few quirks, however, it's mostly the mods that I like. Aditria Watford, formerly into Watford, there's some Schindler M series lifts that have been replaced with Elans and they're so well built and heavy duty. Despite them not leveling very good, they have very good acceleration and deceleration. They also used to do pre doors, but sadly, in 2019, they disabled them. Frown. 8. Anza. Anza make some surprisingly efficient lifts, sometimes they have full intelligent leveling and pre-doors. This is probably because they use new lift logic, a very good logic for what it is. 7. Pickerings. Pickerings used to make some epic, vintage lifts which were full of character and fun to ride. However today they're not doing that great, they're making some really cheap, nasty lifts. But I still think they're awesome older lifts make up for it and they definitely deserve to be in 7th place. 6. Owner, Owner make some really nice, well designed lifts that don't cost a load. Ok, they may not be the most heavy duty lifts, even then they're far from being the cheapest I've seen, but the attention to detail. They're so well designed, they're also quite efficient. Not extremely efficient but reasonable. 5. This Nkrup. This and Krupp have made some epic lifts in the past including some twin lifts. Some of their cheaper current lifts may not be great but their more expensive lifts are still very decent. 4. Otis. Otis are the only reason why the lift community exists, in fact, they're the only reason why lifts exist. All thanks to Elijah Otis, we now have this extraordinary method of transporting things up and down. But anyway. The reason why I like them so much is because of their awesome lifts they've made over the years from Lexan to Gen 2 Life. Some of their lifts, like the cheap Gen 2 branded as Express Evans, may not be great, but then at the same time they make some really nice, well designed lifts. I especially love the 2003 Cone. This company has achieved miracles. Starting with the Cone M series, one of the most efficient lifts ever built. Then, the Eco Disc, the only reason why MRLs exist. Almost all of their lifts are extremely well built and designed, heavy duty and efficient. Cone are just an awesome company altogether. 2. Schindler. Schindler made the best lift ever built in the history of lifts, the Schindler M series. It's outstandingly well built and designed and heavy duty, but most importantly, it uses Myconic, the best logic in the industry. It's so crazily efficient with epic acceleration to deceleration and epic pre-doors. Schindler have proved that it's more than possible to make a super efficient and well built lift. However, the reason why they're only in second place is because some of their modern lifts aren't great. Which brings me to my number one favorite lift company, which is, drumroll please, Mitsubishi. Mitsubishi have never failed to be awesome, they make arguably the best lifts currently on the market, they're almost as good as the Schindler M series, they're very well built, they look awesome and they're extremely efficient. It would probably be possible to overclock them to be even better than the Schindler M series, but I don't know for sure. All of this is the reason as to why Mitsubishi is my number one favorite lift company of all time. Well. That took ages to type and probably barely any time to watch. Now for the classic outro, thank you for watching, please consider subscribing, this has been an everyday everything video and I'll see you later, bye eee. -e 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 -e.